gotta hustle, you gotta be tough. If your dreams don't scale, they ain't big enough. I'm Lexi, and let's just be honest, my dating life kinda sucks. You think it'd be easier dating both males and females because, you know, more fish in the sea, but you'd be wrong. I've been talking to two matchmakers, and I'm just ready to put my dating life in someone else's hands. We've got this huge house, we're gonna bring a bunch of daters here, and hopefully, I'll find love. Let's go. It's so nice to meet you both. Pleasure. I'm Spicy Mari. Nice to meet hey, you. I'm Anthony. Hi. I'm Spicy Mari, relationship expert and magnetic matchmaker, founder of the Spicy Life Relationship Consulting Firm. I help people unlock the power of their passion so that they can attract their purpose mate. I'm Anthony Resinello, a social skills and relationship coach. I've been doing this for the past 15 years. I have a YouTube channel, a podcast, all about teaching you how to get into the right relationships. I'm Let's so excited. Let's chat. All right. So Lexi, tell us a little bit of what you're looking for in a relationship. I'm looking for a person who is adventurous, who likes to travel, who is supportive of me and my pursuits, just like I would be supportive of them. And I'm really hoping you guys can help me find that. I am a Hispanic pansexual female, and I feel like I'm missing a spark in my dating life, to be honest with you. I want to constantly wake up and feel excited to see and be around that special person. Past people that you dated, yep. what were things that you really liked, and what were things that you go, I don't know if I want yeah, that? Yeah, I really care for a person who's communicative. Mm -hmm. I travel often and I think it's really important that a person that I'm with also loves to travel. Mm -hmm. I am very spiritual, I love to manifest, I journal every single day, super important to me. Also, I like loud, just like big personality. Nice. Yes. Yeah. So um, like an extrovert. Yeah, an okay. extrovert. Um, I'm very much an extrovert. I'm loving what I'm hearing. I feel like we can find exactly this. I'm really excited <laughs> to hear that. I'm really excited to hear that. What in a relationship is really important to you? So I would say trustworthy, mm, um, very loyal, doesn't get jealous. Secure. Secure, yeah. it's very secure, yeah. Like what's gonna woo you? I feel like I'm honestly very easily impressed. <laughs> okay. Like you could write me like a love letter. I love or, that. Or it doesn't have to be anything physical either. Just like take me to my favorite place without Aww. telling me or yeah. care about the things that I tell yeah. you. It's like, okay, you care about what I'm telling you. Yeah, they you care really about what attention. I'm saying. Thoughtful. Thoughtful, yeah. yeah. It sounds like you need a lot of quality time, a lot of attention. Yeah, um, but it goes both ways. Okay, and you, you can give it, you can yeah. dish it. Okay. <laughs> oh, and this is another cute tidbit. When I'm taking girls out on a date, I like to plan the date. But when it comes to guys, I don't like doing that. I want them to do that for me. Love it. Oh, this is gonna be fun, Anthony. <laughs> <laughs> this is gonna be so fun. After meeting both Anthony and Madi, I am confident that these dating coaches have what it takes to lead me to love. So what we're gonna do is we're going to look through a bunch of potential matches for you and then narrow it down. We're gonna break up into two teams, all right? Then we're going to put them through some dating challenges, give them some dating coaching, and then find the perfect match for you. Okay, I'm putting my trust in both of your guys' hands. I know you guys will find the one for me and I could not be more excited about this. We got you. All right, Spicy. Yep. The time is now. Time we've been waiting for. We, we're going to choose the matches for Lexi. Let's right? do it. I'm ready. I mean, I love the vibes. It's the color palette of the photo also yeah. matches her outfit, which is attention to detail, and I really Got like that. Got good taste. Silly. Silly. Um, or she snuck something from her parents' bar when she was a kid. I'm not sure what <laughs> I'm seeing here. I think I'm gonna play this one nice and let you have it and oh, not come for you. Yeah. Okay. I think I'm not gonna come for you. I'm sad that I can't have you. I think that being with Anthony, he's gonna help me. I mean, I don't know how much matchmaking coaching I'm gonna need because I'm pretty good at it, but any other help I can get, I'll take it. Ooh, that's beautiful. But Love this great. photo. Like, the athleticism is important, right? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So, I'm liking this so far. I agree. I'm gonna say that I'm gonna fight you for him, because I like him is a it lot. really a fight, though, when you're going up against me? I don't think so. Then we'll find okay, out. Okay, let's find out. 
Luis. Yes, sir. Hi, my name's Anthony. I'm a social and relationship coach. Luis, I teach men how to meet women. <laughs> and I teach men how to keep women. Hey, she's throwing shots, bro. I'm like, I'm like, you spicy man. Huh? I'm sorry, I'm gonna have to go with spicy. I really wanted him. I really wanted him. Spicy. <laughs> so my game plan for this is definitely going confident. I'm trying to have fun. If it's gonna be a fight, I'm really competitive, so I'm going in 100% of the way. I'm not laying down any chance. Yeah. Run, run if you wanna catch me. Busy buddy, finna you can tag me. Run, run if you wanna catch me. Busy buddy, finna you can. I'm never a fan of bathroom photos. This isn't saying anything to me. It just looks like a... Feels like a fail. <laughs> <laughs> now, I'm not sure it, what the context is here. I'm a Capricorn, so I love the goat. Okay. <laughs> Come hither. Oh, I'm <laughs> I'm usually a chaser. Like, I'm on my hands and knees, crawling, begging. Be mine. Ooh, a vision board. Lexi's huge into manifestation, so I am liking the fact that this person's a visionary. It's a little bit of a mess of a vision board. It's not quite organized. I guess I'm just too interesting for Lexi. <laughs> <laughs> and washboard abs. I hate to be superficial, but this is hard work and dedication. Approach. Team Anthony! Wait, there's an A's right here. Team Anthony. That that? Yes! Actually, I heard you speak French too. I do right? speak French. Yeah. Oh, parlez-vous français? Bien sûr. Vous parlez français? No, that's all I know. <laughs> <laughs> I already know. Solid team. We're definitely gonna take home this W. Take home this girl, actually. Hi, welcome hey. to the winning team. Hey. <laughs> Come here. What's good, y'all, man? You already know me. It's your boy, Josh. I'm gonna win it. I'm gonna get the girl. I'm willing to fight to the end for who I want. I predict this experience will be fun, crazy, chaotic, wild, and interesting. <laughs> I feel like she's gonna be coaching us well. We're gonna, we're gonna win. We're gonna do great. Oh! Yeah, boy! Hug it out, baby. The dagger in my heart. That's right. My best physical feature would definitely be my eyebrows. Check these out. I mean, who could say no to these? Sorry, spicy. <laughs> it's okay, it's okay. Call me. <laughs> Hi, everybody. Hi, daters. How you guys doing today? So I think we have some really good matches for Lexi. Now it's time to move them in. And we've been keeping the guys and girls separate this entire dating process, and they don't know about each other. So let's see how this goes. Welcome to the house, daters. I don't feel like competitive with girls, usually. It's just kind of... I either want to be your friend and I want to like understand you emotionally or like I want you. <laughs> I'm seeing all these attractive people walk up with me into this house. I'm so scared because these are gorgeous people and I'm already like, my competition is insane through the roof. And then I see... What the heck? <laughs> Wait. Wait. As I'm walking up, I'm seeing girls and I'm like, what is going on? Why are a bunch of dudes walking in behind us? And why are they hot? Hey, y'all. Come in, come in, come in. Looking delicious over here, yes. We're a good looking crowd. We are stunning. I'm like, so who's dating who? So girls, I'm sure you're a little surprised to see the boys here. <laughs> you all know you've signed up for a dating show and that you've been drafted into two teams, but you're not here to date each other. I'm shocked right now. I had no idea girls are gonna be here. I don't know what's going on. We're gonna be putting you through a series of dating-based challenges, giving you dating advice, and helping you win our match. So are you ready to meet them? Yeah! Yeah, that's what we're talking about. Come on out. Woo! Hey, everyone. <laughs> Lexi walks out, and I'm like, wow. This is my exact type. Thank you very much. She's gorgeous, stunning. And then she had the drip on her. She was stepping. She bad. Hey guys, how's everyone doing? Yeah. I don't want her to see anyone else. Like, me, babe. Me. Like, it's just me. Like, don't worry about all of them. 
They're really good looking, I know, but you don't gotta see that. Like. I'm so excited to see all of you here today. I know this seems kind of crazy, but I'm honestly used to dating both guys and girls, so this is gonna be a really cool experience for me and for you guys. I'm really trying to find my perfect match, so I figured let's bring you all here and have some fun. Yeah! I'm extremely competitive. I have no problem competing for someone, and I know I, I always win, always win. Every girl that I've ever wanted, I've had. That's a bold statement, too. This is gonna be a wild ride. Guys, girls, did you hear that? You both have a chance to win Lexi's heart. It was hard enough fighting dudes, now I gotta fight girls? Girls know what girls want. How can I compete with that? But remember, as your coaches, we're gonna be helping you and your teammates along the way. So our goal here is to try and help one of you to be the last match standing. So <laughs> right now, I'm seeing Lexi, and I wanna go to the end with this girl. Like, there's nothing about her that I wouldn't change. She's perfect. Please get moved in and dressed to impress because we are going to be throwing a party tonight. Let's do it! Oh my god, this house is beautiful. I, first of all, I feel bougie, and I'm honestly so grateful to be here. Woo! I live in a trailer park, so I'm like... Oh my god, I walked out! Where are you from? I'm from Santa Barbara. Where's that? You don't know where Santa Barbara is? Nope. So right out the gates, Tyler is trying to hit on me and I am like, buddy, I'm a lesbian. And he obviously is only trying harder. Okay, so you're from Al Southern. Alabama. Alabama? <laughs> yeah. Really? Yeah. What, what are you doing here? Uh, social media. When it comes to my sexuality, it's, it's probably like a 90 to 10% ratio of liking women to men. I mean, he seems like a good guy to be friends with, but he was kind of growing on me, I'm not gonna lie. But, I mean, he's, he's a funny one. I like him. Hell, I got locked out. We can watch Netflix all day. I feel like coming into this house, I do have rules set on myself to keep me in check because since I have dated pretty much one type before and that's basically people who are very egotistical, very selfish and everything, I feel like I won't let myself get involved with that ever again. We're gonna be with us. Just us. Just us? The sleeping arrangements in the house are me and Jasmine in one bed. All the guys are sleeping in their own bed. But in the other girls' room is Jamie, Sienna, and Rylan. What do you think about the house? This house is fire, bro. I've never been to anything like this. OK, cut to the chase. What do you think about the, the girls? They all bad. I'm not going to lie. A little blondie, I think she's calling my name. Who? Which one? What's her name? Oh, uh, Sienna. Sierra. One of us wrong. <laughs> Some of these girls are catching my eye. Oh, they're gonna get me in trouble. That's it. <laughs> One in the blue top. You know her name? I forgot it. Callista. No, 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 no. Oh, Jamie. No. Jamie. I, I want all the names. Right? I want all the names. <laughs> At the end of the day, the ultimate goal is obviously Lexi, you know, but I can't help but to explore the other options. I mean, it's just there. We gotta fight each other and the girls for yeah, one girl. for one girl. I mean, that just made it harder, to be honest. It did make it a lot harder. So but you, you going for the one girl or you gonna have some fun? I don't know, that's what I gotta figure that's out. What, what are you gonna do? I, I don't even know, I'm here to win though. Low key, so. Well, you're not winning, I'm winning. I hate to tell you, but you know. Win or learn, never lose. I ain't never heard that before. Win or learn, never lose. Yeah, put my boy on. Oh, okay. Hey, second place looks good for you, boss. I feel you. Let me go ahead and ask Sienna how she feel about this. <laughs> it's Sierra. Wow. This is so cute, isn't it? 
How do we claim it? Oh, yeah. This is the life right here. <laughs> We're locked out. Hey, We're boys! Locked We're locked out. We're locked out. Locked out. Locked out. That Remember? sucks. Y'all finna get that locked out, That sucks for you guys. Uh, I guess we won't see you at the party tonight. No, I can't. Yo. No. sets up this party for us to all meet each other, get to know each other, and talk. I was playing friendly, but I really was trying to read everyone and be like, you're going home, you're going home. You're annoying, you're boring, you're rude, you're stuck up, are you here, yikes. Like, I'm fun, I'm cool, but like, they are not kidding. What do you guys think of Lexi? Loki, she's, she's bad. Hey, blonde, she came out blonde, and, and first thing I thought, I was like, oh yeah, it's giving like nice, like mm. nice girl. Oh, yeah, she's like, definitely a nice girl for sure. I just can't wait to talk to her. You know? Yeah, get to know her. Hey, bro, <laughs> here for one reason. And one reason. To win, bro. One reason. One reason. To find love. Hey, this is Sign the vibe you're living here. <laughs> okay. Ooh. Damn. I am looking forward to meeting my fellow competitors, getting to know them better hopefully figuring out what they're here for and what their intentions are. Yes, man. Well. <laughs> no, I'm on Anthony. Damn, are you on the girl's team? Yeah, I'm C-Spicy for okay. sure, bro. Damn. Oh, we out. No, I'm on Anthony. Hey, guys. Hey. Y'all having a good time or what? Yeah. OK, come on. Let's come over here. We got to chat. We got to fill you in on what's going on. Hey, guys. How is everyone doing? Good. Good. Good, I'm so glad to hear that. So I know we all haven't gotten the chance to get to know each other individually yet. So I thought what better way to do that than to do some speed dating. How does that sound? Yeah. All right, I'm not even gonna lie to you. I'm feeling so giddy right now. I'm looking at all of these daters and I feel so lucky and I can't wait to get to know everyone. So how this is gonna work is we're only gonna have three minutes to get to know what? each other. Oh, I know, but hopefully that time will be enough and I'm really looking forward to this. But remember guys, me and Madi are here to coach you in your journey. So we'll be monitoring close by. Okay, so the first person I'm going on a date with is Jamie. And yeah. Yeah. This is gonna be our first glimpse into how the daters interact with Lexi. So I'm really excited about it. I'm curious to see how my team members are gonna be. Are they going to shine or are they gonna be a little socially awkward? Because if so, I'm gonna have to help them out. I like your dress. Thank you. So how are you feeling? I'm feeling good. Yeah. I'm, I'm a little bit nervous, but I'm yeah. really excited about all of this. I want you to tell me about yourself though. Mm, I want you to tell me about you. Okay, you go, where do you go to school? I go to school at American University. Okay. So I'm a double major. Okay. Foreign policy. Oh. DC. And right. And okay. also communication. Where do you go? SBCC. Where, I don't know. Santa Barbara. First impressions, I think she was intentionally making eye contact with me the entire time, and I think she's very, 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 very beautiful. So I'm definitely excited to get to know her more. Tiana and I go to like Santa Barbara, like we're in school together. I don't know who anyone's going to Oh, okay, Santa's the blonde one. Okay. She, we're both in Santa Barbara. Mm -hmm. But I want you to tell me more about Okay, yourself. I like to I write feel... music for fun. Oh. Yes, but I don't do anything with it. Oh, just, like, why? Because I don't you know. You should do it's something like a hobby. with it. I feel like you should do something with it. I don't know. I don't know. We'll see. Maybe one day. <laughs> I like it. Immediately, Lexi and I have a spark. Jamie. Yeah, she's a good one. How was your conversation? It was great, Santa. Awesome. Thanks for like it's, That's so good for you. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Why, why does she seem mad about it? She's mad about it. She is funny. Why are you mad about it? Team Anthony, bro. You're so funny. <laughs> Jamie, <laughs> so funny. That's a good start for Team Anthony right there. Sienna and Jamie are talking. They have definitely like known each other or they're vibing like like something's not right there I haven't put my finger on it yet but you know I'm gonna figure it out like what are some of your passions <laughs> so I grew up and I did like soccer softball musical theater wow. like I did contortionism okay I like circus stuff I went to join the circus I did aerial silks, silks? for like 10 shut years. up I did like professional yeah that's I actually have them so in my cool house. Like you said circus, I had okay, to say. Okay, so I'm coming over. Yeah? <laughs> no, like genuinely, I'm not kidding. I'm oh like, God. okay, so when's the first date? Yeah. Okay. No, I think the connection they're having is really good as friends, but I'm not seeing 
much of an attraction right here, but I'd love to talk to Lexi about it. Hi, yeah, nice to meet you. What's your name? I'm sorry. Thank you. I'm Sienna. Sienna. I'm yeah, Lexi. Yeah, yeah. Where are you from? I'm from Santa Barbara. I don't like how quiet it just got. I know. It's okay though. Know, it's, it's okay. It's okay. 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 It's okay. They they can listen know, to us. It's, it's, we're, we we're we want fiery, them to. You know, they're like, yeah. what is going on? <laughs> they look good. You know, but it's You're fine. Killing You're killing me. You're from Santa Barbara. I'm oh, from Santa the Barbara. First girl I talked to you said that you guys went to college together. She said that. To... That's so interesting. Wait, elaborate. We didn't go to college together. Like. Okay. But we, like, are from the same town. Okay, no, yeah, maybe yeah, that's yeah. what she said. Oh, okay, I'm okay. Sorry, I'm sorry. Oh, no, 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 that's so funny, though. Uh, okay, exactly. tell me more about yourself. I, uh, I make TikToks. I'm okay, like, I'm a singer-songwriter. Like, oh, that's my God, what I amazing. Do right How are you doing? Good. I'm Lexi. What's your that's name? That's good. Cameron. Cameron, yes. tell me more about yourself. Um, I really like snowboarding. That's snowboarding? Like, yeah, that's, like, my first hobby. Like, I love it. Yeah. Um... I'm really good with kids. Okay. I love kids. I have a niece and nephew. Okay, I'm awesome. I'm like a full-time manny for them, so. I have a little sister. Oh, really? Yeah, How old is she? Yeah, she's eight years old. Okay, okay. Yeah, I was like, I want a person that's like good with kids, you know? Yeah. Just because I can run them all day. Yeah. And they keep you young. That's cool. Yeah. I like that. Now, Cameron, to me, he holds really good eye contact, but I want him to be more expressive. Okay, I have a question. Wait, to ask off. me, please. Um, how do you feel about all this? I kind of feel like you're like the middle of the, like, attention <laughs> Wait, of everything. Wait, that's so funny. So I, I, I'm feeling, I, okay, like a little overwhelmed, but like for the most part, just like very excited. Not nervous at all? Um. A little bit. Like no, a little all bit. these people okay. want you though. So it's okay. Like, yeah. Your name I'm, is French. Yes, I'm like first, like first French and then American. That's amazing. Yeah. Those, I like I'm big on traveling. You like to, I was just yeah. Gonna say that. Yeah. Big on traveling. I'll take you to France too. <laughs> no. Oh my gosh. So my type, honestly, it doesn't matter if you're black, green, blue, red, white. Doesn't matter as long as you have like a good face that I can stare into for hours. That's wifey material right there. So you're very beautiful. <laughs> Thank you you're so very, much. You're very, very beautiful. That's so sweet. I have a necklace just like really? just like yours. Where just, are you from? I'm from uh, Salt Lake City, Utah. Oh. Yeah. Wow. I'm from Utah boy. Wow. I've never been to Utah. Really? Okay. I go to uh, junior college right now. Mm -hmm. I played basketball and I actually just quit this year college basketball. Oh wow. Yeah. I want to focus on like myself now and kind of just That's amazing. do me. No, I know? like that. And I kind of like fell off. I feel like basketball. I know, but like it's not falling off. Like I feel like a lot of people lose sight of like what is most important, which is like really focusing on yourself yeah, and no, like totally, focusing 100%. on what matters most exactly. to you. Oh, give me a hug. <laughs> How you doing? What's your name? Tyler. Tyler. I like your accent, Tyler. Appreciate it. <laughs> I like your accent, Tyler. I'm from Alabama. Where are you from? I'm from Florida. What are your really? hobbies? Are you in um, school? So I went to Alabama University for a little bit. Did a year of college. Okay. Now I'm kind of just chilling. Mm -hmm. I'm doing social media. I love that. Got a marketing agency coming out. That's awesome. Yeah. So I'm just kind of doing that. Are you excited about all of this? How are your feelings? I'm excited to meet you. Like you came out, and I thought you looked really, really beautiful. That's literally the sweetest thing ever. I know. Thank I you. I think it's your smile. That, like, You're literally out. making me blush. Like, that's so <laughs> nice. That's so sweet. You're also very pretty. This whole time, I'm just looking at her eyes. She's so beautiful. I can't. I can't look away. What do you do? Are you in school? Do you have a job? Like, what? What's um, your? I did go path? to school and everything, but since I'm very family orientated, I'm really close to my grandma. Mm -hmm. I decided she got really sick. Oh my so god. So I decided to. Um, at school and then work full time and help out with her bills. I'm really sorry to hear that. No, you're fine. That's you're a fine. Lot, yeah, it is, but it is what it is. So Jazz is doing a great job of already leaning into the emotional intimacy. She's sharing about her family, core values. So tell me about yourself, Calista. Oh my God. Ah, I love it. The oh tooth God. gem. Thank you. Yeah, you want one? I do. All right, gotcha. Ah. I'll take care <laughs> of that, you're baby. You're crazy. I love I'll it. I'll take care of you. <laughs> but my ex, he would say, crazy wasn't in the fine print. And I would say, crazy was in bold print. Do you like to travel? I love traveling. Where's oh your favorite God. place you've been? Guatemala. Guatemala? You only live close to Mexico, too. It's like yeah. Awesome. <laughs> Have you ever been to Mexico? I've never been to Mexico. Well, Guatemala is like Mexico, technically, I think. I don't think so. Oh, did I never been to Mexico? <laughs> So I don't know geography. <laughs> That's okay. That well. <laughs> That's okay. I have an airhead. Oh no. I got you this ring and match. Oh my god. Your dress and your shoes. What? Yes. <laughs> Thank you. I hope you love it. <laughs> it's very so cute. I like this blue. I was get, you were giving you like, like Aquarius vibe. Ah. So, yeah, I don't know. I was like very sun kissed, very sun Thank kissed you. with the freckles. And <laughs> no, they're fake. They're fake. I shouldn't have told you that. I shouldn't have told you that. You can't tell anyone. It's, it's our a secret. little secret. <laughs> it's a secret. 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 It's
to buy energy. I'm fluid pansexual, so you brought together like such a good group of people. No, seriously, so. like this this actually is amazing. I think Lexi's great. I think I have a connection with her that no one in this house has. Tell um, me about yourself. Where are you from? Are you Twenty hobbies? years old. You're Twenty years old. I'm from Charlotte, North Carolina. Oh my gosh, what? I, have, I, I was born in North Carolina. No, okay, stop. Okay, so I tell everyone I'm from Florida, but I was born in North Carolina. I go to college in Miami. What? That's Wait, crazy. what school? University of Miami. Oh my god, I'm I'm from Naples. <laughs> Wait, that's wow. crazy. Yeah, it's, University of Miami is sick. It's What's really your major? Nice. I'm political science and theater. What the f are you kidding me? I'm sorry, I don't know if I'm allowed to curse, but I am a foreign policy and politics major. No, way, no Wait, crazy. we have so much in common. I know, I that's this. really weird. It's funny. <laughs> Lexi has already touched him like 10 times. He's got her. I, I'm a, he's got her right now. He has her attention. I'm gonna teach him how to like seal the deal. So how do you? I'm 19. Are you big on signs? I mean, not necessarily signs, but definitely spirituality, like manifesting, I believe. That makes sense. Energy. I'm really big on manifesting. Energy you put out into the world is what you're gonna receive. Mm -hmm. I just started like trying to like meditate and get right really? spiritually. Wait, yeah. I love that. Yeah, I took this class That's big and I was for like, me. really? Yeah, meditation you should know that. Right? That's big for me. Hi. How are you doing, Lexi? I'm Lexi. I, oh my gosh, that nice was to meet so you. sweet. Give me a hug. What's your name? Luis. Luis? Yeah. Yeah. Um, where are you from, Luis? I'm from LP, La Puente, California. Uh, I heard you're actually like Hispanic. Where are you from? I am. I'm from Mexico. Mexico? Spain. Which part? Mexico City. Mexico City? Yeah. I'm from Zacatecas. Oh my gosh. Yeah, are you serious? Yeah. I do speak Spanish. Un poquito. Un poquito. Vale. Me gusta tu acento. ¿En serio? Tu acento, yeah. Mi acento. En serio, de veras. <laughs> Gracias, por supuesto. So you live in California? Yeah. I'm moving here. Oh, that works great for me. <laughs> Do you want to move in? <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, you're making me nervous. <laughs> well, are you okay? Are you okay? <laughs> what an entrance to have. <laughs> well, give me a hug. Hugs? What's your name? Cammy. You're so pretty. How oh, are thank you? Thank you. I'm good. How I are you? You should get okay. one. Oh my God. It's okay. It's okay. Everything's fine. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> hmm. Sorry, can okay. you tell me your name one more time? Cammy. Cammy. I love every kind of music. Do you okay. like music? I love music. Yeah. Who's music your person? favorite artist? It depends. If I'm in my car, young boy. I, I'm one oh, of those girls. I, no, but like I like that. Okay, you do? Okay. <laughs> and then I can, if I'm I can rock to some vibing. <laughs> yeah, right? <laughs> like anybody who can listen to it. Oh, I love it. I really, really am attracted to people who are creative. Like off rip, if you're someone that plays music, writes music, loves music, loves to paint, draw, fashion, clothes, thrifting, like anything that's creative, like I'm just 10 times more drawn to you. So I definitely look for more creative people. Ladies, Hello. yes. Okay, I hate to break up this love fest, but it's time for us to talk to you, Lexi, and pick your brain about the experience. Okay, so I'm getting up. Yes. All right. Bye, love. Great job, though. I have some tips for you, boo. Let's <laughs> Guys, that was so fun. Did oh, you have a good really time? Yeah. yeah. That was really a cool experience. Yeah, I want to know who your favorite is. Yeah, okay. who, give so, us like top contenders. I would have to say for girls, um, the first girl I talked to, Jamie. Yes. Felt and I knew it. instant mm -hmm. connection. As soon as like I genuinely, saw yeah. like mm -hmm. eyes weren't leaving each other. Mm -hmm. Yeah. The other girl that I enjoyed talking to a lot, Camille, mm -hmm. um, who was the last girl I was yes. just talking yeah. to, she had a great energy. We had a lot in common. Yep. There was one girl in a really pretty dress. Her name was Callista, I yeah, think. Yeah, Callista. And she is definitely out there. I was trying to watch sense. your guys' energy and it looked- I couldn't match it. Yeah, it looked I couldn't as match if it. she was like, rawr. Which is okay, <laughs> which is okay. In terms of men, um, I enjoyed talking to Joshua. Joshua was I saw was all smiles really with cool. Joshua. Yeah, because I've you seen him. touched him probably like, Okay, times. you know what? We're not gonna talk about that. <laughs> <laughs> the other guy I liked talking to a lot was Brian. He um, yeah. he talked to me about his sexuality and he told me how proud he is of me for mm -hmm. like doing this and bridging the gap or whatever. But he he was really cool. Did you find him attractive? I do find him attractive. Okay. So do you think you have a good idea of who you want to bring to the next level? I think I do. Mm. I think I do. I need your guys' help. We got you. Of course. <laughs> I'm really excited. Yeah. I really, I really totally am. just have a good time with it. At Thank the end you. of the day, like, let's find out who's gonna be like an awesome friend, and then we can start thinking about like an awesome lover. Yeah. yeah. But this is just the beginning. I know. This yeah. is your first day. I know. Okay. <laughs> because all of these first impressions, that's all they are supposed to be. I know. First impressions. As the days go on, you're gonna make more connections. They're gonna get deeper. You're gonna probably even change your mind about something. I know. Yeah. I know. As you this go is along. just for so, yeah. Yeah. You're right. 
Well, I'm so glad we got to have this talk. Cool. Let's, let's head inside. inside. Yeah. Perfect. All right. So, we all know a big part of dating is breakups. <laughs> which is why at the end of each day, there's gonna be an elimination ceremony where you run the risk of getting unmatched and getting sent home. Oh. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Get scared. My relationship so far in connection with Lexi, I think that we've hit it off very well. And honestly, I'm not too worried about getting eliminated tonight. On the screen in front of you all are going to appear your dating profiles. <laughs> if you see a heart, that means you're safe. But if you see an X, that means you are at risk of going home. But if you make that bottom list, that chopping block list, we're gonna try to help out as much as possible to keep you here. But don't worry, guys. We're not your coaches for nothing. From there, I will be making my decisions on who is staying and who unfortunately has to go home. I know we got a chance to mingle and talk to each other one-on-one, -on -one, but I know you guys also got to talk to each other throughout the day as well. So I want to know what some of your first impressions are with each other. So I have some questions for you guys. Uh, the first question I want to ask you all is, who do you think could possibly be here for the wrong reasons? Anyone can answer. Anyone can answer. <laughs> Yeah, Come on, she wants something real. Let's keep it 100. Come on. Dish it. Hey, Tyler, it's on you, bro. Tyler, it's on you, bro. Why do you want me to answer? Come on, Tyler. You're bold. Dude. I bet. Bold, bold. Brian. Brian. Oh. Who's Brian? Who's Brian? Oh, wait. Who's Brian? Who's Brian? Who's Brian? Who's Brian? <laughs> it's got to be your name, right? Yeah, it's my name. Okay. I'm joking. I'm joking. I'm thinking it wasn't his name. Why do you think that? I don't know. I just got the vibe when I met him to be honest. Oh. Man, we in the elimination. It is crazy, like, somebody really gotta go home. It's the first day and somebody already going home. Yeah, no, I just feel like his intentions are elsewhere. Okay. <laughs> um, it sounds like they're intimidated yeah. by him. Brian, watch your back. They're intimidated by him. So I do have another question, guys. Um, have you guys observed any red flags in your fellow contestants? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Dish yeah. it, what is it? Um, don't start drama, Cammy. Don't start drama. Some of us have just came in here with, you know, past. That's all. Yeah, that's all I'll say. I want to know more. Yeah. Come on, you've got to hey, hey. spill the tea. No, I'm good. Guys. So what's going on? <laughs> we got some Do toxic you know what's stuff going on? going on over I here. I don't know what's going on. Ooh. Crickets. We're gonna find out. I bet you we're gonna find out I later. Yeah, the plot thickens. Remember guys, you're here for Lexi, okay? So everyone, I think I'm ready to make some decisions. So the first person I wanna talk about is Joshua. Um, Joshua, I had a really good time speaking with you today. I think our three minute date went really well. We have a lot in common, um, like a lot in common, oh, which wow. I thought was really exciting. So you are still a match. Yeah! <laughs> Boys. Our conversation was really good. She wanted to talk to your boy some more, you know what I'm saying? Peep the swag I had. So we finna chop it up some more and see what I can do. The next person I want to talk about is Lewis. So I had a really great time talking with you tonight. There were a couple things that I noticed that I didn't like. I thought it was just a little awkward when you kissed me on the hand. Um, I don't know, Ooh. I just thought it was like a weird introduction. So for those reasons, Luis. Tonight, you are going to be on the chopping block, unfortunately. Dang. That's it. <laughs> <laughs> My date was not that bad. I'm pretty sure somebody else had to screw up more than me. The next person I want to talk about is Callista. So I had a really great time talking with you tonight, Callista. I did feel a little bit concerned that some of our conversations were a little bit on the surface level. And because of that, I just really want to get to know you more because I thought we really vibed. It was hard for me to remember like certain things about you, maybe because I was just like staring at your eyes too much, but I do want to get to know you more. Um, and so for that reason, I'm going to be keeping you as a match. The next person I would like to address is Jamie. Um, Jamie, you were probably my favorite person that I talked to tonight. Sorry to be very candid with everyone. Um, I really, really enjoy talking to you. You are a lovely person and I'm very excited to get to know you more. Because of that, I'm keeping you as a match. Woo! And the last person I would like to talk about tonight is Cameron. 
Cameron, I really love talking to you tonight, but I want to know more about you. And I thought that a lot of the conversation, like it just, some of it didn't flow very well. And because of that tonight, you are going to be on the chopping block, unfortunately. Man. You should have chose my team. <laughs> so can I please have Luis and Cameron step forward? I'm going to be talking to my dating coaches. They will be helping me make my final decision tonight. So I will be back in a little bit and we will see who's going home. I'm going home. Guys, I have a really difficult decision to make tonight. It's what we're here for. Yeah. Let me tell you right now, it would be a smart decision to keep Luis, okay? He may have came on a little bit strong when it came to like touching you and it was kind of corny, but I can tell that there's like romance at heart. He's gonna court you, he's gonna like woo you, knock you off your feet, and you wanted someone who was gonna like plan dates for you, and he totally seems like someone who you were hitting it off with as far as like, you guys were speaking Spanish together. It was like really sexy and romantic. Like I can see that there was some type of connection we got to give it a little bit more massaging. Honestly, you know, I saw a lot of performance from Luis. Mm. The, the whole kissing thing, I don't know. It was kind of cheesy to me. I like Cameron a lot, and I get that he wasn't that expressive with you. Or charismatic at all. His vibe, to me at least, <laughs> he was really chill. He was really relaxed. And he, to me at least, it looked like he was really interested in you. He wasn't trying to perform, to do all of this big stuff. He wasn't trying He wanted to interact with you. I'm gonna have to disagree yeah. on this. Yeah. Like, I feel like Cameron was extremely bland. He did yeah. not, like, step but up and try to, This is the difference like, between you and me. You want the big performance. So does I Lexi. care about the connection. Lexi wants the big performance, too. She wants to know that, like, <laughs> you are the apple of her eye. And he- I don't know what Cameron, apple of her eye means, Cameron. but I know, I, <laughs> all I know- Guys, I think you guys both make like a lot of good points, genuinely. Yeah. And this is a really difficult decision for me, but I do think I know in my heart what's right. And I think I've made the decision. Okay. Got it. When you know, you know. All right. Let's let's Trust go break you. the let's news. Let's get back over there. Yeah. <laughs> my amazing dating coaches, they both gave me some really good advice and some good insight. But unfortunately, I did have to come to a decision and I think I'm gonna have to go on my gut feeling with this one and send home the person that I felt less of a connection with. And because of that, I'm sorry, Cameron, but you've been unmatched. And I'm really sorry, please give me a big hug. You're awesome. Thank you. You're make me so sad, no! <laughs> This sucks that I'm going home. This house is huge. Lexi's hot. There's food here, but see ya. So I hope you guys all had a really good time today. That was emotional, but I'm really looking forward to getting to know all of you throughout this process. And I hope you have a great night and sleep well. I'll see you tomorrow. Yeah. See you guys tomorrow. <laughs> oh, that was bad. Heartbroken. I think this experience is going to be once in a lifetime for me. Not only am I going to learn a lot about myself, I potentially will find love. And I think just, it's gonna be a lot for me. I don't know what to expect. I am really excited because today we're doing our first challenge. Woo! I'm carrying the team, it's bitch just standing behind me. Oh, I don't wanna get wet. Get in the ice, get in the ice. Alicia is acting so fugazi. The same he's pulling on Lexi, he did to Jasmine, and he did the same thing to Rylan. You're a rook, you're learning. Sorry. That's all about it. I've heard of love triangles, but I think I might be in a little bit of a love diamond, you know? We were never official, we never, she's never my girlfriend, so she's my friend. Mm -hmm.